Hey everyone, it's your girl Karen. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. And in today's video, I'm gonna show you guys how I crimp my hair. Yeah, so um, as you can see, I have crimped my hair and I'm gonna show you guys in this video exactly how I did it. All you're gonna need is a barrel with a crimp. You don't really need the special hair crimping tool. You could just use one that looks like this and it could be, um, it could range from like half inch. I believe this is one and a half, but it really doesn't matter. You could just use any one, but your crimp will vary depending on the size of your barrel. So just keep that in mind. Um, I do suggest that if you do have shorter hair, to go for a smaller barrel just because um, you don't really you want to have like as many crimps as possible for the length of your hair my hair is really long it's literally up to my belly button so for me it's not really an issue if I use like a one and a half inch barrel but for someone who has maybe like short hair up to here maybe you want your crimps to be a lot smaller and you want to have like more crimps going on so depending on what look you're really going for um, you could use different barrel sizes however this technique is for anyone and everyone however depending on the size of your barrel it will vary um, the look will vary so just keep that in mind I hope that was helpful I don't always use heat protectant to be honest probably should. Make sure you grab your heat protectant spray if you need it. Um, for me personally, I just don't use it. Maybe in the future I will, but just you know, lately I just haven't been using one. So if you guys want to learn how I crimp my hair, make sure you stay tuned. Okay, so this is what the crimped hair looks like now. My hair is really dark, so it's kind of hard to see sometimes, but um, yeah. Here's what I'm going to do. For example, Take it like three pieces. Okay, so I'm gonna take this piece and work this. Do that. And then reverse. And you keep doing that until you have all your prints in your hair. And when you do this, you're not gonna want to like tighten your hair like this and do it because then it's gonna be harder to curl. So kind of like, um, don't have too much control of your hair. Just kind of like let it loose a little while you're doing it. So it allows the curling iron to really do its job and crimp your hair. But you also don't wanna hold on to it like too loose the point where you lose the form of the curl so it's really just a balance it's really just getting the hang of it um, it's probably I probably accidentally made it sound much harder than it really is but like once you do this a couple times like you'll get the hang of it and trust me you'll get a lot of practice because crimping takes time <laughs> yeah okay so there you go there's there's that that's a good one Okay, so I'll show you guys one more. Um, okay, take this part. I'm gonna start this way now. I want to go to the way top because you could actually see the crimps this time around. It's not like it's covered by layers, like you could actually see the crimps. So, Focus um, on how you want your crimps to look towards the top. If you care a lot about the aesthetics and framing your face and how you want the top part of your hair to look, this is where you need to focus on that. I'm just looking at myself in my bathroom here, if you guys were wondering. Okay, 
So there's that. Is it cute? Can you guys see? So there's that side. Then I'll finish this side and I'll be right back. Last but not least, so now that I am done with my curls, I am going to add my oil to finish it off. And it's the Unite U Oil, the Argan Oil. So I'll rub this. That. And then apply it on the ends first, and then the rest I just like to evenly disperse. Throughout my head of hair. So I feel like a mermaid now. I hope you guys all enjoyed this video and I hope it was helpful. If you guys liked it, make sure you hit the thumbs up button. It helps me out a lot. And also be sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell so you will never miss a video from me. I hope you guys have a fantastic rest of your day and I'll see you guys in my next video.